people being evil, but it's really funny and entertaining. I don't know about you guys, but that sounds amazing. This random number texted me accidentally and I couldn't help myself, LMAO. Hey, when you get home and you get the baby settled, can you call me? I thought you had the baby. What? <laughs> That's so mean. <laughs> okay, this is the first time we're on the found Satan subreddit. And yeah, I understand it now. Years ago, my mother-in-law began reading The Exorcist. She said that it was the most evil book she had ever read. So evil, in fact, that she couldn't even finish it. She took it over to the beach and threw it into the ocean off a fishing pier. I went and bought another copy. I ran the faucet over it and I left it in the night table drawer by her bed. My father-in-law said that night was the first time she ever screamed and fainted. <laughs> I'm going to hell, but I'll go laughing. That's the most incredible thing <laughs> I think I've ever read. You evil, evil person. <laughs> but I'm so glad you did this. My mum grounded me, so I catfished her for six months and broke her heart. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> like the other one was just a funny prank. That's like a genuinely hurtful. I got banned from Cheat Code Central when I was a kid for posting elaborate time-wasting fake cheats <laughs> for various games that I never played. Right, so I'm upset that we haven't made a video on this already. This is so amazing. So somebody's selling a mannequin. My daughter doesn't want it. Freaks her out. I want to get my money back or best offer. I'll give you a hundred dollars to tell her that it's sold. Hide it in the attic for two weeks. Take it out and put it back in her room while she's sleeping. <laughs> that not okay. <laughs> but I'm so glad you said that. My boyfriend is extremely against weed, but apparently not against cheating. Oh, so guess who's getting brownies right before their drug test for work next week? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this one is justified. My niece turned three today. She asked for a Lion King cake, but specifically the moment where Mufasa dies, because I quote, everyone will be too sad to eat the cake and it will be all for me. <laughs> Genius. How is anybody that smart? when they're three. I feel like I couldn't even speak when I was three. I'm 23 now and I still can't speak. Be naked at my sister's wedding. My sister is having an outdoor wedding in you somewhere <laughs> in May. I want somebody to be naked in the woods and to run through the wedding in order to ruin it. I will protect you from my family. <laughs> That's so terrible. Like, I don't want to be too quick to judge. Judge. Maybe they deserve it. <laughs> no, two wrongs don't make a right. Two wrongs don't make a right, Bart. Yes, they do. No, they don't. Yes, they do. No, they don't. Yes, they do. Dad! Two wrongs make a right, Lisa. You know, like, we do need more context here, but that's a pretty evil thing to do. After much thought and consideration, I've come to the scientific conclusion that we should use a light show drones to scare the crap out of uncontacted tribes. <laughs> North Sentinel Island, is that what it's called? Yeah, um, <laughs> you've never seen civilization <laughs> and you see a huge skull with a sombrero on in the sky. <laughs> I love how this entire subreddit is like a guilty pleasure. Like, oh my god, that's awful. But at the same time, incredible. The downstairs neighbor just installed a stripper pole. <laughs> And the screws are going through your floor. Hook a car battery to it. Also, does four screws really hold up a stripper pole? <laughs> like that thing's gonna come down, isn't it? I'm in a Walmart parking lot watching a woman who can't remember where she parked. Every time she holds her remote in the air, I honk my horn. <laughs> 
Oh, God. <laughs> this is devious, but I love it. A daycare dad cut me off in the parking lot, so I went early yesterday and I taught his kid how to ride a bike. You can never get that back. That's the evilest thing I can imagine. Right, so I may be very dumb. <laughs> and that's the end of the sentence. No, but they're joking, aren't they? Because if you care that much about somebody cutting you off, you need to sort that out. I made a life-size AirPod stickers and I stuck them on the ground all over the city. <laughs> That's amazing. Well, I just want to say that I'm a huge fan. That's so... Awesome. <laughs> I love Call of Duty Modern Warfare crossplay. I said, Xbox, turn off. And I turned off some kid's Xbox mid game. Oh my god, like when people mess with people's Google Homes in videos. I could do it right now to everybody at home that has a Google Home nearby, but I'm not that evil. Hey Google, subscribe to Vinci. <laughs> yeah, that literally said, how do they hear me? <laughs> That's so far away. It's important. When you're writing a female character, is there hodonka donka donks? I should probably turn that off. I grounded my kid. And this was his response. Taking all of the labels off your canned food. <laughs> Honestly, kind of genius. Today, I was so bored. I saw an ant in my kitchen and I placed a few sugar cubes in front of her. She had some and she went to tell her friends. And then I quickly hid the sugar cubes because I wanted them to think she's a liar. <laughs> How dare you. Toying with humans is one thing, but ants and their little little families? Not okay. If you had to design a harmless but annoying virus, what would you do? You have a strong urge to sneeze, but you can't actually sneeze. Alright, calm down, Satan. <laughs> yeah, don't you dare. Like, I know some people are evil, but this evil? I didn't know that. I spilled my drink trying to put my seatbelt on, and look at this mother flipper. Not the popo. Yeah, but why are you driving without a seatbelt? So they're not wearing a seatbelt and they also whip their phone out to take this photo while they're driving. <laughs> Listen, I'm not mad at the person in the not the popo car. I want to record an audio book that's eight hours of breathing and page turning and then just, oh, you mean out loud? Right at the end. <laughs> oh, I love this so much, but I also hate it. True story, I'm flying right now, but through Wi-Fi and an app on my phone, I'm honking the horn on my car back home to annoy my family. The future is now. Hey, the neighbor's kids challenged us to a water fight. I'm in. Just waiting for the water to boil. <laughs> yeah. After reading about all of this very evil behavior, Let's read something wholesome. Hi. Ah! <laughs> Wait, no, look, it has pockets. Ah, <laughs> I love it. Twisted Doodles, that's a very, well, that's a very good name. Twisted Doodles. <laughs> um, um, yes, but also a very cute comic. When you want to take a cozy nap or be left alone for seven and a half months. <laughs> I'll come back later. I'm hibernating for half of a year. Oh, cat, your life is simple and good. I wish we could could swap. No, but you're so capable of so much more. And I can't wait to see what you do with your big complicated human life. <laughs> Thank you, cat. I really appreciate it. Speaking of cat, I watched Puss in Boots the other day. Incredible movie. And yeah, that's the end of that sentence. <laughs> Thank you for joining me today, guys. I hope you had a wonderful time. And if you did, annihilate that like button and let me know down below if you want to see more. And the comment of the day goes to Tidbit. The final diddly sounds like the name of the final boss music for Ned Flanders in a Dark Souls-like game. <laughs> Could you imagine? 
in a Dark Souls-like game with Ned Flanders in it? Oh my god. <laughs> that would be incredible. Beyond incredible. That would be perfect. So yeah, I don't know about you, Tidbit, but this needs to happen. <laughs> like, that needs to be a game. The Simpsons Hit and Run is awesome, but a Dark Souls-like Simpsons game with a Ned Flanders boss in it as the final diddly? Please, we need this. All right, guys, thank you again for all your support. I really appreciate it. Have a beautiful, amazing, incredible rest of your day, and I'll be back tomorrow with more. And with that being said, bye! <laughs>